Good evening, hookers. Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. Today we're in my new kitchen and we're gonna make a bomb ass motherfucking burrito. Okay. Now I got my Rosa Rosarita fucking beans. I'm gonna put some cheese in it. These fucking tortillas are bomb. They are the sun-dried tomato fucking mission wraps. And if you have not tried these, you have to fucking try them. They are bomb in a burrito. And then maybe some cilantro, onion, and what else am I missing? I think that's literally all I'm putting in the burrito. But it is 3.09, and I am home alone for the, like the first time, literally. Everyone went away this weekend, so I was like, you know what? I'm going to just fucking work my ass off and make YouTube video after YouTube video because I'm not here to be interrupted, okay, by a fucking bitch and their loud ass mouth this weekend. So I'm going to start putting this shit. Ooh, come on, Angles. I'm going to start by uh, putting a pot on the stove. Now, I'm only going to do, like, low temp because I just want it, like, hello. I just want it warm enough to, like, where the beans will melt the cheese with it because I'm mixing the beans with the, the cheese and then maybe adding some onions in it. Where the fuck is a can opener? Oop. Okay, this will be interesting. <laughs> this is so stupid. Okay. Oh, do you guys want to see a life hack of the century? Okay, so you see how it went like that? Like it, it's in the thing, you can't get it out? Child, let me tell you the best life hack ever. You get a refrigerator magnet. Look at that. But you gotta be careful. Don't cut yourself. Okay, babe? I'm just gonna throw that away. Um, yeah. Life hack. Ugh, I need a spoon or something. Ew, it looks like dog food, but don't be tripping. It's, it's actually really good. Ew. That was very... I, I, I don't even want to talk about it. I, just, I don't even want to talk about it. Okay. I'm just going to mix it around a little bit. Ooh, this shit is on high. Turn that down. Let the beans warm up a little bit. And then once we do that, I'm going to start adding shit to the mixture. Okay, whatever. I'm gonna bring you over here. Let's go. Okay. Okay, the cilantro you put in last, and I don't wanna hear no ifs, ands, or buts about that shit, because it is so specific, it's on God, okay? Tortillas, I don't know, should I steam it? That is too much work. I'm just gonna put it on the grill. I'm gonna start cutting. Uh, some onions right here. I can't let the beans burn because they actually will burn. So you gotta keep an eye on that. Where is the knives? Right here. I'm all over the place today. All over the place, okay? So don't say I didn't warn you because this could be a shit show. Okay. I'm just gonna dice up them little bitches. Okay, that's, that's great. And that's great. <laughs> Do you wanna see this? Yeah. Let me just almost slice my fucking hand off really quick. This is a mess. Ugh, I chef Gordon Ramsay the fuck out this burrito, for real. You gotta mix it. You gotta mix it. Okay. Okay. 
Is it enough for the burrito? Not really. I like a lot of onions in it, actually. Make sure you peel the fucking skin off of it. Like, for real. Mmm. Once I get, once you get the hang of it, it really goes fast. It really does. I don't know what that is. That's, mm -mm, we're not doing that. There we go. Okay, so I think that's enough onions. <sighs> I'm already tired. That, I'm, uh, that, that was tiring, for real. A lot of concentration, so I don't slip my fucking finger open. So I'm just going to add the mixture of the onions. I'm going to put it through the hole. Um, and this little thing. I'm not going to do these because these are too big. But once you add this to your mixture, you just got to keep mixing it. Mix it all together and you know you get the best of both worlds. Might need a little bit more onion. Yeah. That's not gonna do it for me. That it really is not. I said I'm making a bomb ass burrito, not a fucking chintzy ass Taco Bell looking ass burrito. Okay. You better you better red neck and eyes. This onion is freaking me out. The texture of it is just not giving. Ew, that sound. Scary. Terrifying. Terrifying. Look at my little plants. Look at the moment. Uh, I don't have time for the angles, so I'm just going to... Do what I can, literally. Oh, oh, that's a big onion. Oh, let me just cut my hand off. That hurt. I mean, that's not really that much more onions, but it does make a difference. It really does. I actually never knew about these tortillas, right? Because I've never seen them before. And my, my aunt actually made burritos one time at her house with it. And I was like, what is that? Like, are they good? And let me tell you, were they good? Oh, they were. They were everything. They were everything and then some. Like, I want them every time I have a burrito now. I'm just going to add some cheese to the mixture so it makes it a little more like. Just a little bit more, mm, you know, give me that oomph. Mm. Give me that oomph. Mm. Um, and while this is like melting, I'm actually gonna turn on the other. Hello? How do I do that? There we go. I'm actually gonna. Oh my god, I can't I don't even want to explain myself. I'm making a burrito. You know how to make a burrito. It's a tortilla, right? And some beans. Oh, to die for! Ooh, that boozy good is to die for. Okay, I'm just gonna. Woo! I just burnt my fucking tortilla. Don't burn your fucking tortilla, for real. It's on site if you burn your tortilla. You can't even see it. Woo! Okay, I need to I need to do that again. I'm gonna move you to over here. Um, I kind of need a plate. I'm gonna... No, this is a proper mukbang. We get an actual plate. Look at that. Normally, I would get a paper plate and just say fuck it. I don't like doing dishes that much, to be honest. 
But, like, this is a mukbang or whatever. You better fucking step your pussy up. Be careful. Don't burn yourself. Don't try this at home if you are not experienced in uh, cooking on a stove with a tortilla that is hot because this shit will creep up on you and it will burn the fuck out of your hand. Okay? I am not kidding. The ends are a little hard, so we're going to try to fix that by just putting it on the stove. Okay. Let's make this motherfucking burrito. Tea. This is tea. I'm just putting it over the tortilla vibes. You kind of want to put it to the side now I think about it. Ooh. I could make two burritos. It's kind of a lot of food, though. I'm going to turn this off. <laughs> I don't have a good angle. I'm sorry. But we're just going to have to deal with it. Okay? Let's be honest. That's kind of a lot. Slay. I'm gonna add some cheese. Ooh. I want that cheese to be falling apart in this burrito. And now I do have some cilantro. I do love a good cilantro in a burrito. I am not gonna lie. Give me some onions, some cilantro, some salsa, and we can get it cracking. For real. Now we just roll it. We're gonna roll it. Get some fucking cilantro out of here. Mm, yes. Like that. And there's your. There's my burrito. It's a little, um, like, tilted, like it's going to fall apart any second now, but it's a burrito. That's for damn sure. Wash your hands, wash your hands, and put all this shit away. So I'm going to put away the cheese and the cilantro. And onion. Look at our fridge. It's kind of full. Cilantro. Cilantro. This onion, which I think I got yesterday. That is actually the wrong drawer for that. So whatever. Okay, let's just try this burrito. The, it, the anticipation is killing me. Okay, ready? Mm. Um, it's pretty good. Now the tortilla is a little... It's a little hard, but I could get past that. Mm. You gotta do that burrito dance. Yeah, this is pretty good. Mm. Wait, what is this? How to make sun-dried tomato basil wraps. It looks like they have peppers, garlic, onions. Mmm. That cilantro in this is kind of good. Hella good. Mmm. 
Now, what are we eating to drink? I mean, eating. I'm all over the place. Now, what's to drink? This is probably the worst live I've ever done. Uh, in the feng shui. I don't even know. Weave tastes like La Croix, Pumple Mousse. Kind of tastes like soap, actually. Mm. Mm. Look at our table. We got a new table. Okay, I'm gonna get my burrito. And my LaCroix, my LaCroix. And we're gonna have a mukbang kiki, if you will. And I'm gonna answer some hot burning questions that you guys have, okay? Whoa. Let me just fucking break shit. Okay, so a question someone has asked is, how do you like your house? My new house, because I did move. I used to live in an apartment. It was ghetto, just kidding. <laughs> it, was not, it wasn't that ghetto, but um, someone did get shot there, so. Mm. <laughs> About that. Someone got shot in the laundry room. Two days. No, it was, was it four days? It was literally two days after we moved. Someone got shot in our laundry room of our old apartment. Kind of scary because we lived right next to the laundry room. Like it was down the stairs and to the left. So it was like the building next to our house. But other than that, I actually do love my new house. Um, I just don't like that we're in the location that we're in because it's kind of ghetto. There's like nowhere to do anything. It's not ghetto. The house is big though, which I like. The location is not ghetto. It's just like, there's nothing to do in the area. But I do love my I love my little room. I keep my room clean all the time. We keep the little house clean. And I have yet to show you guys on YouTube my new house. But it's actually pretty much fully done. So I will show you, I think maybe maybe next week. I feel like we're ready next week for a house tour because I know y'all have been asking me, been bugging me about a house tour. Mm. It will happen. It will happen. This burrito's good, but I think I could do better on the tortilla. Like, give me a steamed tortilla. Ooh, that's leaking out the bottom of it. Let's go on Twitter, and we're gonna we're gonna see. Lock him up. Who was who are we locking up? Donald Trump. <laughs> Anyways. Mm. Mm. Oh, really good. Mm. Very good. Food coma. Mm. I've been watching Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. Not Beverly Hills, New York. And it's like my favorite show ever. Yeah.
Yeah. What's popping on TikTok? I promise I'm not a pervert. This app will not stop showing me half naked women. Right, 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 right. I've been bouncing back on YouTube lately. It's hard posting once a week. Like, oh my God. Especially because it's not my full-time job. Like, if it was my full-time job, I would love it. But it's just so hard. That engagement has not been... It's actually been doing good, but like... Not. I don't know. I'm not making money off of it. That's for damn sure. I'm not making money off this shit. Obviously. But... One day, when I am consistent, it will happen. Oh my god, my hair is so long. Ooh, don't even turn to that side. <gasps> I have a very ex exciting... I can't even think. I'm low-key in a food coma. I didn't eat this morning. I have a very exciting video for you guys and I hope you guys really do like it because it's more like reminiscing of when I first started my YouTube channel, which is kind of great. I do want to film that tonight. Tonight? Should I make it tonight? I think I should make it today. But a milkshake sounds really good right now. There's your hint. <laughs> That's your hint. But I hope you guys I hope you guys really did like this video. I will talk to you guys later. And make sure you like and subscribe for more videos like this, more lives. And there will be a surprise video. What's today? tomorrow there will be a surprise video tomorrow don't hold me accountable for it though because it might be monday it might be sunday but we'll aim for tomorrow okay i love you guys bye